Definitely. Good morning, Naledi. And of course, uh, to the viewers, we are coming to you live from the Stillfontaine's Magistrates Court, just outside uh, Tlexdorp, where the 20 suspected illegal miners are expected to appear before this uh, specific court. You would know, as you've mentioned there on the intro, that they were arrested on Monday following the arrest by the Hogs. They are facing um, four charges, and these are conspiracy to um, conspiracy to robbery, to wit gold, um, possession of prohibited firearms, possession of ammunition and contravention of uh, the Immigration Act. We were told yesterday by Minister Bikikele that fi- uh, 15, 13 of uh, the suspects rather are from Lesotho, five from South Africa, one from Eswatini and the other from uh, Zimbabwe. Now, this of course uh, suspect appearing here, as I stated earlier on, just after the arrest by the Hogs, they were uh, arrested at the Scott mine shaft, which we saw yesterday. This is a disused mine shaft, quite uh, something that we see mostly on a regular basis in this uh, still fountain and the Tlegsdorp areas. We understand that the 20 of them will be appearing for the first time here, the um, still fountain magistrates court in Naledi. But if I can just give you the background as far as the challenge of illegal mining is concerned here in the northwest, Actually, we do understand that five uh, provinces, that's where you would find illegal mining. This is Northwest, this is Gauteng, Mpumalanga, Limpopo, and of course the Free State. This is according to Minister Bekitele. And the other charge which speaks to possession of prohibited firearms, if I can just detail it there, that the suspects were found with 15 AK-47s. And you would know that as the minister reiterated yesterday, they are not in the South African system. System. Now, the question being, this high-caliber the, the high of weapons, the um, suspects are having quite concerning. The minister did indicate that the other um, gun there, being the R5, might be the one that was robbed from any of uh, the police stations here in the country. In fact, they are tra- trying to trace it back. And of course, they were also found with about 6,000 rounds of ammunition in lady. Keep showing us around there and explain to us just to the outside. I see a massive police presence. Is this, of course, in response to the large numbers that we saw outside of um, or, or in the area yesterday with the arrival of the police minister? I mean, are we expecting a big response today from the community that seemed to have been um, incredibly vocal yesterday in those conversations with Police Minister Begitele? Uh, definitely, Naledi, if my colleagues uh, can just pan around and show you, yes, we do have police uh, presence and uh, just in front of me, some of uh, community members, of course, we have not established as yet if they are here for this uh, particular appearance. But I can tell you, Naledi, that when it comes to illegal mining here in uh, Stillfontaine, Tlexdorp, Kuma areas, residents are quite concerned. In actual fact, we had the other one yesterday detailing at least, giving it to the minister, saying that they... Uh, um, demand his attention given the high rate of crime in this area areas they were not only talking about the issue of illegal mining they were just talking about crime in general saying that it needs to be prioritized as far as the crime in this area needing to be kept but you, you look we've covered this uh, stories and uh, lady illegal mining just last year October we covered a story where uh, four decomposed bodies of uh, suspected illegal miners were on the surface and of course we saw again just April this year, over 80 illegal miners, suspected illegal miners being arrested and they retaliated uh, with the police killing just about six. When you go to residents in these areas, Analedi, some will be quite confident to voice their concerns about illegal mining. Others really are not uh, keen on doing that, given uh, the fact and suspicions that some of the community members uh, are housing some of these suspected illegal miners. I should find them um, farming, in, I mean, actually renting in uh, different areas. And lady, those are the allegations, but go to different areas. Some would be saying, look, police needs to deal with this illegal uh, mining issue, but most importantly, um, calling to the Minister of Mineral Resources, Minister Gwede Mantashe, to ensure that the disused mine shafts are rehabilitated, saying most of the mine owners, when they, uh, they stop using 
those mines when they are no longer operational they leave them as they are residents saying because of this now this will of course mean Zamazamas will come to those disused mines those are their concerns but we will hear what how the cause goes to the aspires the appearance of this 20 illegal miners